still needs Brixton. Still. Brixton still needs Brixton. Still. Brixton still needs Brixton. Still. Where the fire still burns and the heart still beats. Fire burns. Heart still beats. Heart still fights with no fear still. Heart still grows and it carries on still. For Brixton still needs Brixton still. Where the rivers flow with the fallen blood. Fire still burns in my neighborhoods cause maps mar. Battled up the streets where the fire still burns and the heart still beats. Brixton still needs Brixton. Brixton still needs Brixton. Brixton still needs Brixton. Where the fire still burns and the heart still beats. I love the fact that Brixton can suddenly explode. Because Brixton is the only town that's always been that ball. We have that inch. It's an open hit inside. But Brixton has led to grow from the cinders of the fire amongst the law, amongst the field, amongst the hope of my community. I love Brixton. Can you not see? Fire burns. Heart still beats. Heart still fights with no fear still. Heart still grows and it carries on still. For Brixton still is Brixton. Still. Where the rivers flow with the full blood. And the fire still burns in my neighborhood's cause maps. Battle along the streets where the fire still burns and the heart still beats. I love the smell of the markets and the noise of the bars. I love the growing culture of Brixton's growing art. I love all the restaurants and jewelries and foods it has to offer. I love all the different faces of my sisters and my brothers amongst the law, the field, the hope of my community. I love Brixton. Can you not see? Blue sky, summer hands. Basket Brixton sunk today to the south of Brixton Sunday. This is not beautiful for people who deny their past. My brothers, my grandparents, my mother, my father did not suffer and die to give me an education to slight, oppress, or discourage my people. Because whatsoever education I acquired out of their sacrifice of over 300 years, I shall use for the salvation of the 400 million black people of the world. And the day when I forsake my people, may God Almighty say there shall be no more life for you. <laughs> Unequivocally rejected the racist assumption of much white American Christianity. Namely, that God had created a black man inferior and that he had intended Negroes to be a servant class, hewers of wood and drawers of water. Well, I predicated my view of man and the doctrine. <laughs> if death has power, then count on me to be the real Marcus Garvey I would like to be. If I may come in an earthquake or a plague or a pestilence or as God would have me, then be assured that I shall never desert you and make your enemies triumph over you.